again and welcome to my channel. I'm Fraser from Metalworking in France. A uh, little project I have on today, uh, a gentleman has brought me a, an ash can basically uh, for a, a stove of some description. Um, as you can see it's now in two bits. Um, it used to be something like that but as you can see it's got an hole in it. Basically uh, it gets a bit messy when you try and take the ash out of the fire and it goes all over the living room. So I'm going to make a new ash pan for this and fit it onto this ornate front of the fire. So follow me in this video and uh, see how we get on with this. And don't forget while you're watching, uh, while, while you're watching the video, please subscribe and share. So uh, let's see how this, this job progresses. So here you can see I've marked out the base uh, of the ash can. Um, it's uh, a little bit uh, rough and ready at, at the moment. Uh, I've just got a, I've cut along these lines here and this will be folded up, this one folded up and then this piece, this section here will be wrapped around and riveted onto the back. So uh, it should be okay actually. I've just got to clean up this radius a little bit here which sits into the into the ash can itself. So I'll, I'll just show you what the two of them look like, or oh, back to back would probably be the better way around. You can see that uh, these two units are pretty much the same. Uh, this, is, this is how it will fit onto there. Oh, it won't fit on there, but it's, uh, that's where we have the, the shape from. And then I can go ahead and cut this and bend it and see how we get on with it. So here we have the new ash pan, all bent up uh, quite nicely. It's, quite, it's formed quite nicely. I've got to stick a couple of rivets in here uh, just to, well, to hold this where I put this, to, where I bent this round the back here. Um, and I'll just put a couple of rivets in there just to hold that in there. And that should be quite nice then. Uh, it's actually better than the original one. It's, it's thicker material for a start and also uh, it's galvanised so it should last quite a while. Okay, so I'll just get this riveted up and we'll see how this looks. Well, there you are. That's the job complete. Uh, there's the old one and there's the new one uh, riveted up. Uh, I have to, did have to use a couple of bot rivets um, just in this piece, uh, uh, not here, but on the end here because I couldn't afford to try and uh, beat the, the rivet, rivets over um, to try and try and smooth them over. So I've used pop rivets in those, but the rest of them are actually, they're actually pop rivets with the pin taken out and then I've used them like ordinary rivets and riveted it over. So uh, yeah, quite a good piece of kit now. So anyway, hope you enjoyed that video. Look out for more videos in the future. And if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.